Let's head now to Jiayi County for a look at the fisheries of tomorrow. Since 2021, the Southern County has chosen 15 exceptional fish farmers to roll out a new high-tech system for aquaculture. The Farmers Association is increasing production with smart tech and generating solar power at the same time. The locals hope the project will attract more young farmers into the field. This 3.5 hectare fish pond is covered in solar panels. Along Jiayi's coast, including in Budai and Dongshi townships, fish farming and green energy are combined by many companies. This fisherman, surnamed Chen, took over his father's fish pond more than 50 years ago. We went and did solar panels. We signed the contract four years ago. The current area of aquaculture is about 5,800 hectares, of which almost 100 hectares are actually in operation. But the large areas of fish ponds covered in solar panels and leased out have decreased the active fisheries in the area. How to keep fish ponds open is a big question. Jiayi County's latest trick is smart aquaculture, which is transforming traditional fish farming. If we talk about perch, for example, one pond might be 3 to 4 million, an extra 10 to 20 percent income. Then things might be different. Firstly, with raising prawns, in the past it was a 30 to 40 percent survival rate. We can raise that to 85 percent or more. With greater survival rates for fish, as well as the income from solar energy, these smart aquaculture policies are paying off. Officials and fish farmers have had their noses to the grindstone. The whole government is helping our fishers to transition towards smart agricultural technology. I think this will change the whole farming culture in Taiwan. In the aquaculture industry, we have to improve as a whole. As we push forward the combination of fisheries and energy production, we want to make sure we upgrade the technology of aquaculture both indoors and outdoors. As traditional fish farming transforms into the fisheries of tomorrow, the county government is keen to roll out airtight policies that will attract more professionals into the field.